If you watched my last video, you saw how amazing the Daytona Reptile Show was. And I came back with a really awesome reptile that I'll be showing you guys in today's video. I am super excited, so let's just get straight into it. to the channel guys uh, if you are new here my name is Alex I make videos on all things reptiles and amphibians so if you're into that kind of stuff please make sure you subscribe so you don't miss anything guys here we have them the California king snake this is what I picked up at Daytona uh, it's a snake I've wanted for uh, quite a while now since I first saw them um, and guys I'm just so in love with him he's such a cool snake so far um, I've had him for about five four or five days now and he has been awesome normally snakes take a while to acclimate to a new environment before they can start feeding he ate with me the second day he was here uh, so that's always a good sign keen snakes are known for having a really big appetite so they actually even eat other snakes which is pretty cool um, in the wild they'll have a checkered pattern and a lot of the times they're they won't be so black and white. Sometimes they'll be more brownish and more yellowish as well. So this is a really cool one. Um, I just love, love his pattern. You can see he's a very active snake, lots of tongue flicks, trying to figure out what's going on. Um, yeah, he's got this really, really cool um, belly pattern as well. Uh, the underside of his belly is kind of like this, more, more of a brownish color as opposed to the black that he has throughout his body. But yeah, guys, super duper cool he um he's a colubrid just like meliotis so they have very similar uh body sh body and head shapes uh they'll actually grow to about the same size both species are usually four to five feet sometimes they get up to six but that's pretty rare um but yeah guys just a super duper awesome snake i love his pattern love his personality so far i'm just really really excited to to have him and watch him grow um, as far as name goes, I named him McFlurry for obvious reasons, and I actually really, really like that name. So this is McFlurry, and yeah, guys, I'm just super duper stoked to have him. Like, just, I think his pattern is so, so cool. And I really like how, how dark his, his eyes are. They're like a jet black color. Um, probably the darkest out of all my animals in terms of just eyes like it's really sick in my opinion he's got a cool little head stamp I like this little one splotch of white that he has on his head I love love the stripes and just how funky looking his pattern is like everything is kind of unpredictable I guess I like this, this side patterning that he has as well just honestly everything about this snake is super duper cool um, but yeah guys, this is McFlurry. I'll be Something I like to do with all my animals when I get them is weigh them. Um, so that way I have a nice little baseline how, how much they weighed when I got them. And then that way I can track their progress to make sure they're um, gaining weight at a, at a reasonable pace. So with that in mind, let's see if this guy will stay on. He is 21.1 grams. Not bad at all. So guys, this is his current setup. It's just a 20 gallon long. This is perfect for a baby. Obviously he'll need something bigger eventually, but for now it's got everything he needs. It's got his water bowl, some places to hide, uh, some rocks, give him different textures, some sticks to climb, his light, his heating. And I used a uh, sand and topsoil mix, but I went more heavy on the sand just because they are a more arid species, so they don't need as much humidity. But yeah, guys, this is his setup. Where are you going? <laughs> Where are you going? So yeah, guys, we're just gonna put him back, let him, let him explore a bit. Um, but yeah, that is McFlurry. <laughs> he is... Honestly, just such a cool, cool snake, guys. Very inquisitive, very curious, and honestly, just beautiful. 
What's up, little buddy? Yeah, he's just there, like, why did you guys take me out? <laughs> Bye, guys. That is McFlurry. I hope you guys... Oops. Sorry, buddy. Didn't mean to scare you. I hope you guys enjoyed the video. Um, I'll be updating you guys as he continues to grow. And, yeah. That pretty much does it for this one. As always, guys, thank you for watching and enjoy your reptiles.